I'm doing this podcast about traveling, and I need you to just be totally, totally honest. No exaggerations whatsoever. Lauren, we asked Johnny on a scale of 1 to 10 how difficult an actual flyer he is. I would say 20. (laughs) Yeah, we had one assistant quit because she just couldn't deal with the shit. To your point, does the Xanax ever backfire when I change my flights? Yeah. The answer is unequivocally yes. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. 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 <laughs> and there's been times I've landed places and I'm like, I didn't pack any underwear. And I wake up to like a knocking on the window and a flashlight that's the cops. And I'm like, ugh. And my pants are unbuttoned. Yo, my pants are unbuttoned. I'm like, ah. Is this your bag over here? Because it smells like weed. They thought they had the bust of a lifetime. <laughs> Denver International Airport because of all the conspiracy shit. Yeah. yeah. That horse fell on the sculptor that made it and killed him. Oh and they God. still kept it up? Yeah, it's up. Working Wi Fi or working television? Wi Fi. Why? Television. <laughs> Athlete's foot, smelly feet, dirty ass feet, God knows what kind of feet. The passenger next to me gets no time. I don't give a fuck who it is. It could be, you know, I want to have a conversation with Jay-Z. I think Jay crossed, wouldn't want yeah. to talk to you. No, 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 for sure. My legs are up like this against the door. Against the fucking door of the Which, airplane. to be fair, not that far. It's very... It's yes, very it's tight. very tight. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just like, I'm trying like... For 40 plus minutes. The the stewardess is knocking on the door. She's like, are you okay? I'm like, I'm good. I'm good. You're not somebody who would like dive into the whole experience and be like, oh, I'm going to go skydiving. <laughs> no. 